Okay, we can sync these two up here. So let's go ahead and do it, okay? And there we go. Have fun dying together. They almost look like they're holding hands. <laughs> oh, guys, that's so cute. You guys are so cute. Hey, guys, welcome to Plants vs. Zombies Neighborhood Defense. Now, I've been playing a lot of Plants vs. Zombies 3, and let's just say I'm looking for something different. And this game is supposed to be actually really good. It's a fan game. It's got a different style, but it's got all the things you love in Plants vs. Zombies. So, we're gonna go ahead and start the adventure, guys. Check this out, okay? This is pretty cool because, you know, it is, it's supposed to be like, kind of like a Plants vs. Zombies 1 fan game, but it's got some like, uh, some things that you might recognize from Plants vs. Zombies 2 as well. Uh, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna get in here, to be honest, okay? Let's go to the first level. Wow, look at that lawn, look at that zombie. It's a zombie. It's actually kind of nice that they tell you what it is. Obviously, we know that's a zombie, but I'm pretty sure the idea is some zombies have different names. Duh. Here's some sun. Here's a thing. Whoa. Just out of habit, I pressed the number one on my keyboard because that's how I play PVZ2 and it worked. That's awesome. It's also how I play PVZ3, I suppose, so that that's cool. But yeah, that's great. It's already added into the game. You just hit the uh, hit the number keys. Zombie number one, look at him go. Beautiful. No speed up button in this game, guys. That's uh, probably my only complaint, to be honest, because I uh, I like being able to speed the game up a little bit. Because, you know, sometimes you just, you're sitting there and you're waiting for zombies to die. Like, come on, zombies, just die already. All right, there goes another zombie's head. I need some more sun to, there we go, thank you. Now we can kill the zombie even faster. I don't know, I, I, I was gonna say maybe this is the last zombie, but of course it's not because we're waiting on a flag here, okay? And then there should be a wave, I suppose. This is basically just PVZ1 level one where they tell you how the game works. Very nice. Final wave. Well, I like the music. I didn't know if they were gonna have any new music or it was just gonna be the regular PVZ music, but this sounds new to me. Actually, no, I recognize it. Oh, there's a zombie on your lawn. I know what you're playing right now. And yeah, there is a zombie on my lawn. Several zombies. Why won't they just die? Have another pea shooter. Jeez. Oh, look at this, guys. This is already better than Plants vs. Zombies 3, okay? Because you beat a level, then you unlock a new plant, and then you get to use the plant if you want, you know? Well, in this case, we only have two plants, so you're not exactly gonna be able to pick or whatever. Sunflowers are essential for you to produce extra sun. It's a very nice prize, guys. I just, I just like this, like, progression so much better than what they did in PvZ 3. I like that it just pops up, shows you what it's about, and then you move on, you know? I don't know, man, I just, PVZ3, man, it just doesn't scratch my itch, you know? And I, I wanted to play this game and then PVZ3 came out and I was like, okay, I guess I'll focus on PVZ3. So now, finally, I get to play this game. Thank you, sunflowers. What was that? They kind of just like open their mouth a little bit and out pops some sun. I don't know what kind of health my plants have. It's probably similar to, you know, normal PVZ games. So that's cool. There's over 60 levels in this, guys, but I don't know what kind of content is in here. There's like new zombies and things. There are things that you will have never seen in a PVZ game, so that'll be cool. Actually, look, I can't tell you what is or isn't in PVZ games because I haven't played every PVZ game, which reminds me I need to play Garden Warfare. Do you want to see me play Garden Warfare? Because I've heard it's good, but I don't know if anyone plays it anymore or really cares about it. Okay, so we have a zombie with a cardboard box on his head. How many hits does it take to kill him? Let's see how strong he is. Well, we're, we're breaking down the box. It's just a cardboard box. I feel like a cardboard box zombie would be uh, weaker than a cone zombie, you know? Because cones are pretty strong. If I was gonna get into a fight with someone, I'd rather have a traffic cone than a cardboard box. Let's just put it that way. See guys, look at this, I'm collecting money you know, like, like, like how it is in Plants vs. Zombies 1. Like, I can't believe they didn't put a system like this in PVZ 3. Like, that was my favorite part, going to Dave's car and buying his wares. You know, you had a little control over how you actually played the game. 
Having control over a game you're playing, that'd be crazy, wouldn't it, EA? I didn't mean for this video to be me complaining about PvZ3, okay? So I'll shut up. You already know my opinion on PvZ3 at this point. If you don't, go back and watch my final PvZ3 video where I basically just gave up on the game. I might go back, we'll see. Potato mine explode on contact, but they take time to arm. Indubitably, look at all these lanes, guys. So many lanes. Who's that? Oh yeah, we can actually uh, highlight the zombies now and we can take a look at their names, which is great. Zombies deserve names too, guys. Okay, so when sun falls from the sky, it gives me 50, but when it comes out of one of these, it only gives me 25. You're getting a potato mine for sure. It's nice to see, you know, the plants we all love, but in like pixel format. I gotta give it to the person who made this game. It's pretty cool. There's another one. That'll explode these guys. Cause I just wanna get as many sunflowers as I can. I mean, obviously, it's PVZ. Spit out, baby! I like the way he just turned into ash. Okay, come on out, buddy, there you go. Boom. This game just works so far. Like it just, it just, it functions properly. <laughs> now can this potato mine get two zombies? If it comes in, oh, it only killed one. Well, we're gonna have to like really get going on this guy. He just, he survived, I can't believe that. Here, you might be uh, the first zombie to eat a plant. You're gonna go down in history, bro. There he goes. He couldn't do it, folks. Now who is this? Who is that guy? I wish we, wait, what, what the heck is he? No! Are you throwing paper? What kind of idiot throws paper? Can I do this? Oh, he's eating it. Why are you eating it? I guess it's kind of a good thing because we can sort of distract him. That's an interesting zombie anyway. Paper throwing zombie. Gosh. Guess I should fill my other lanes up. So it's sort of like, it's sort of like Zombotany, right? Like in Zombotany where you have the, uh, the zombie with the pea shooter on its head. That guy was basically like a pea shooter zombie. But it's level three. It's not even a mini game. Here comes the huge wave of zombies on my lawn. By the way, in case you didn't know where the zombies were gonna be. Kill that zombie with the paper. Don't let him throw his paper at you. You, you do not put up with that type of behavior, okay? There we go, beautiful. Uh-oh, another one. We might have to put up with some of his behavior. I think he has to walk to this one though. So we might be able, no, oh, he threw paper. He only got to throw one piece of paper, folks. All right, and look at that, guys. We unlocked another plant. This is crazy, bro. We're getting so many plants in my Plants vs. Zombies game. I gotta look at this zombie. He is a paper thrower zombie, and this is a box head zombie. Very cool. Seriously, it's just nice that you can look at the names. Uh-oh. We got ourselves. oh, is this, are we bowling? No. No, we're not bowling. Okay, well, I probably shouldn't have put that there then. Whatever, it's fine. For a second, I thought maybe we were bowling. Okay, because that would have been cool. We'll double up on this guy up top because, nah, we're good. We would have been fine. The box head zombie still had his box on, but it should only take a few, uh, a few squares anyway, so that's cool. Okay, let's blow the next guy up too, because that's great. I kind of like the idea of this guy not actually having anything to throw stuff at, although maybe he can throw stuff at my uh, potato mine. I saw him eat it, which was cool. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, snap, it's a cherry bomb. Boom, baby. Oh, God. That was, that. I don't, what? So, <laughs> All right, listen, listen. Um, let's see if maybe we can get these two zombies to sort of sync up a little bit so that we can kill them both at the same time. All right, and go. You guys are gonna have to blow up at the same time now, okay? Yeah, cherry bomb. I guess it only works a little bit. I thought it was gonna do like a, a, a three by three. Let's see if we can blow, but we, we blew them both up. Very nice. Let's see what this can actually do. Okay, it has some sort of area of impact, maybe. Seeing a lot of zombies in this fourth lane here, guys. But I've got lots of potato mines, so I don't even care. Okay, we can sync these two up here. So let's go ahead and do it, okay? And there we go. 
Have fun dying together. They almost look like they're holding hands. Oh, <laughs> guys, that's so cute. You guys are so cute. All right, we're done. We did. Oh, big bag of cash. Yeah. I wonder if it has like premium currency in it or something, guys. Okay, where are we now? They, they brought us back up to the menu. So that's, that's, that's nice of them. We have 350 bucks now. What, what's this? Oh, nighttime. I guess we haven't unlocked nighttime yet. What's that, water? Oh, pool levels, okay. Daytime, nighttime, pool. So we have uh, obviously a few levels to do, guys, but look at all this stuff we're gonna collect. I just, I love that. I love that for me. Just wanted to come out here and check if there was like something for me to spend my money on. There isn't. There probably will be. Oh, we got conehead zombies now, folks. All right then. You think you think you're gonna have any luck against me, huh? I got four plants. Don't even think about. Don't even think about throwing stuff. Oh wait a minute. Well that's bad because now the other zombie's in the way. Stop it. I'm gonna let the other zombie blow up, okay? Even if it kills my pea shooter. I don't know if that zombie's gonna get a chance to blow up. He blew up and my pea shooter died. This is a sad day. So yeah, you don't want these guys to be behind the other zombies, right? Cause they'll just stand there and start wailing on you. That's like a whole other thing to deal with now. That's a conehead zombie. That was the perfect zombie to get blown up by a potato mine. Beautiful. Everything is coming together. Like I said, coneheads are probably stronger than the uh, box zombies. Just taking a few shots to get rid of that cone for sure. That guy died. Ooh, a thousand bucks! Holy crap! <laughs> okay. I did not expect that to be worth a thousand. I would have been happy if that was worth like 200 bucks since I only had 355 before that. That's a, yeah, that's a big increase on my money. I just want them all to clump up. They can eat this little guy and then they're all gonna blow up. Not all of them, of course. Um, I'm gonna put this in front as a little meat shield so he can hit that and not my uh, pea shooter, okay? These guys will blow up and then we can finish him off. Better hurry, actually, because there's zombies behind him. There goes his hat. Come on. Come on. Oh, dear. Didn't happen. That's a thing. I kind of like it, though. I, it's kind of an amusing little uh, situation. <laughs> Okay, so I have a new, like, arch enemy in this game, and it's the, uh, friggin' paper-throwing zombie. It's just paper. You wouldn't think it'd be a big deal, but he knows how to, he knows how to make your life a little less enjoyable. Okay, which of these lanes is gonna be a problem? I think I can answer that question pretty easily. It's the one with all the friggin' zombies in it. Stop, zombies. Uh, make, make love, not war. Well, at least these guys should blow up. There we go, I was close. It was a little close. All right, bye-bye. I said bye-bye. I said, I said goodbye. I can't believe he did that, guys. He killed my pea shooter on the way out. Bro, I gotta put that back again, okay? How dare you? I'm just gonna keep playing the game. You, you think I'm gonna stop the game? You think I'm gonna stop the game just because the level's over? Nah, nah, I don't need to do that. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> Cherry bomb can blow up all the zombies in a three by three area. Oh, hang on a second. This is two cherry bombs. What is this? Oh, okay, this just brings you back out. That's two cherry bombs. Earlier I was only putting one out, right? So I guess that's why it was only, it was only meant for like small explosions. These guys are for bigger explosions. Are they like, is he browsing on his phone while the other one sleeps? This is like me and my girlfriend at night. She's like sound asleep and I'm like scrolling. <laughs> what do we got here? What is that? I need to know what that is. It's a statue zombie, guys. A statue zombie. What the heck is that about? Also, when do I get to spend my money? Look at all that money that's just burning a hole in my wallet. Oh, yeah, you know this guy's getting blown up with a potato mine. Okay, you know the drill by now. Actually, I'm excited to get this cherry bomb out, guys. It's been a long time since I bought a cherry bomb. At least in the sense where you use the sun to buy it. I did buy a cherry bomb in Plants vs. Zombies 3 a few times, but I had to spend my ch cherry bombs on it. Uh, uh, they, they, oh, I did buy more. But you, but, you, but you have them, and then you just use them when you want, and then you have to buy more in the shop. Anyway, the, the point is, it's nice that the cherry bomb is a plant again, okay? That's all I'm trying to say. Sometimes I get a little wordy. Maybe I should just shut up. 
Oh my god, there it is, guys, the statue. So it acts kind of like the, um, maybe, anyway. It kind of seems like it acts like the, uh, the ice in the frostbite caves with the big guy pushing it, or the arcade machine with the big guy pushing it. You know, the big guy comes in and pushes stuff. Although that just seems to be a, a statue. Like, it just came out of nowhere and it's just difficult to destroy. <laughs> okay. Could blow you up with a cherry bomb. That'd be cool. But I won't. You guys, you, you better hurry. That is quite the statue. There we go, we got it. All right. Oh my God, another statue. And you threw it out right as this guy was about to die. Okay, that is not cool. I have to do this now, I think. Man, can you imagine playing a game of Plants vs. Zombies and having to like think on the fly and like do stuff? That's crazy. Okay, it died. The zombie did, so let's go ahead and, uh, and put this out. Try and get rid of it. Okay, and here comes wave number one. So the only issue, oh my God, can you stop? Can I blow this guy up or what? Can't, I get my cooldowns, man. I can't really get anything. I have to stall this guy so he can actually blow up. I think I'm gonna wait for that cherry bomb to come back. It has a really long recharge. Oh, dude, that was, we got it. We're lucky. Now, if I have plants in the way, they can't possibly throw out uh, statues, can they? Like that, that, that's not a thing, right? Uh-oh. Did that zombie come out of the statue? Here comes the huge wave of zombies. Dee -dee -dee. Oh my god, did you just do... No, bruh. Okay, here's what I'm doing. I'm getting rid of all of them. And this zombie right here. And powie. Can't believe that happens, man. I was hoping that wasn't gonna happen, you know? Ooh, a gold coin, $15. You'll love to see it. Stop it, bro. Stop it. It's time for you to go home. And by go home, I mean back where you came from, which is being dead. Yeah, that makes total sense. Good, I'm glad that I'm making total sense right now. Snow pee! Snow pee fires frozen peas, which slow down zombies speed. All right, now we have the same stuff. Ah, uh, ho, 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 ho. Can you believe it, guys? The things we take for granted, you know? Like being able to pick plants. Nobody ever had to worry about that until PVZ3 came out. I'm, I'm, I'm failing the challenge again, no! For absolutely no reason, I would just like to point out that I am delighted by the fact that I can not only pick my plants, but also there's a whole bunch of plants, okay? That's awesome. I don't know why some of them are pink. Can't wait to find out. Okay, so we're gonna go for a U. And a U, U, U. Oh, 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 this one. I guess that's just how it's gonna be. I feel like I'm getting a little overwhelmed with the zombies at the moment, guys. I swear it came out of nowhere, man. Uh, okay. Zombies do come out of these things, man. I, I thought that zombies came out of these things and then I wasn't really sure and now that's kind of a, that's kind of a concern, okay? It's kind of a major concern. I'm afraid this guy, uh, he ate, he ate the thing. You know what? Honestly, heck the top lane. I don't even care about it anymore. There's like nothing left in it. I'm just gonna go for uh, the other lanes right now. And we'll deal with the top lane later. I haven't even seen the mowers in action yet. Can't, can't do them yourself right now, maybe later. I don't know. But here it comes. Pop, pop, pop. You love to see it. Hey, look who it is, guys. Mr. Throws Stuff. And he's here to throw stuff. Or is he? Check it out. Boom. See, the problem is these statues provide such such a good like meat shield you know it's brutal please eat this and not my other thing uh you know what i just uh gonna put one of these back here like that and i'll just wait for the zombies to get there and destroy it we should be all right you know i'm just gonna go ahead and help you guys well no hang on a second let's see if we can slow them down enough to get them all clumped up it's possible now listen some of you guys are speeding up some of you guys need to slow down okay that didn't really work the way I intended it to. And, okay, so you guys are good. Hopefully you all blow up now. You didn't all blow up, huh? All right, one last thing, because I don't want you to use my mower. You know what? I kind of forgot that there are five mowers as well, because I'm kind of used to there being one mower now. I like this better. And spit out. Ooh, my favorite plant, folks. 
Not my favorite plant, but it is one of my favorite plants in this whole series. I don't even know why. It's, it's twice as good as a pea shooter. Like, once you get this plant, you're like, pea shooter, never again. You know? Like, twice the density of peas coming out. That's great. Now you can take a pea twice as fast. Oh, screen door zombies here, folks. Now, things are going to start getting tricky. Sort of. I think I'm going to leave this guy out, and I'm going to leave this guy out. So what we're going to do is we're going to have our cherry bomb this time. Oh. Look at the eyebrows on this repeater, guys. I'm just... Uh, I didn't really notice that before. Like I said, I like this guy's eyebrows, but the repeater has some insane brow going on, you know? Also, what's this button? There's like a, a, a hat button. Maybe you can put hats on your plants. That'd be pretty cool. Really want to know what the pink plant is, guys. Really want to know. Oh, great. I knew that was going to happen, guys. I'm putting that way up here. Uh, oof. And we need to deal with the other guy, too. And there's also the zombie that came out of the statue. Okay. Eat that. Or don't. Now, I kind of want to use the cherry bomb on these guys. All right. Here comes a slew of zombies. Don't even bother. That's what the cherry bomb is for. Right there. Beautiful. Got to put these guys out to stop the statues. Oh, man. Look at all those statues, bro. Here you go. Double repeaters. We have to do this. I think I might actually end up putting a, a nut in front of these guys, too, if we can. Okay, well, we got a, we got a, a slower in front now. I hope that helps. I hope you don't just eat that guy. I mean, there's a lot of peas getting shot at you. Want to use one of these? Just going to wait for the perfect moment to do that. Hmm. Let's do it here. Here? Yeah, that took out a lot of zombies. I got two grand. When do I get to spend my money? A couple of extra peas for you, okay? Yeah. Bag of money, baby. Bloop, 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 bloop. Ding, 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 ding. I think this might be a bowling level because that's what that little thing is, right? Did it, did it, did it, did it, do. Oh, check it out. They're actually using bowling bulbs from PVZ2. How cool is that, guys? Like, this game is basically PVZ1 with PVZ2 plants in it. Sometimes, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how many... I don't know which plants are actually in this game. I think I did see some more PVZ2 plants, though. That's awesome. Oh, that was one that slows. Oh, I gotta remember that, then. I don't want to use that unless I have to. Tong. Do it again. Tong. You might want to actually, you know, bounce off. A zombie and hit another zombie. Bounce upwards, please. Up that way. Thank you. Did we hit him? I think we did. Blow him up. Let's try that. Boom. Probably can use that in a situation where there's more zombies around. Maybe we can try it here. Perfect. And that's a zombie. Whoa, they really be hitting us with these guys. And then I gotta break that open. And then a zombie's gonna come out. Or not. I don't like how close these zombies are getting to me, guys. I don't like that that screen door did not, uh, uh, we didn't get both screen door zombies then. I need, I need the zombies to chill, okay? I wanted to get that guy first because obviously the explosion is better on him and then go. Okay, we're gonna make it out of Gulag yet. I feel like I've never played a difficult zomb zombie bowling level, you know? This is probably the closest we're gonna get to it. I guess I can't lose now because I've got all my uh, my mowers, so that's good. Not that I uh, would wanna lose either way, but you know, it's good, good to know what my options are here. Come on, another, another! Oh, geez. Okay, I need an explosion right here. That's gone, that's nice. Explosion, please, explosion! I need an explosion! Okay. All right, yeah, definitely. Oh, there's my explosion. Hey. I actually managed to do it without hitting any mowers, but it was really, really close. And now we have our very own bowling bulb. Bowling ball! Bowling bulb rolls shots that can bounce into multiple zombies. Oh my, what is that? Gardener zombie. That's crazy, bro. I feel like if I use the repeater, I have to use this guy as well because he's cheap at the beginning when I'm trying to save money. And like, if we don't have anything cheaper, then I need to save 200 bucks just to kill a zombie or 150, I guess. So we'll try that. Um, 
The bowling bulb, I definitely have to try it in this level. And I maybe this guy. It's 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 hard to decide. Can I have a shop where I can buy more slots or something? Nah, wouldn't that be cool? Three flags in this one, guys. This is a big level, okay? Guys, this ain't good. I should have put my repeaters in the back, I think. We might have to use uh, sunflowers as uh, shields in the front. Man, this level tough! I don't have any mowers either! I think I would rather have a cherry bomb after going through this level, so... I feel much safer this time, guys. Mainly because my repeaters are in the back, so we have a lot, we have a lot more time to kill the zombies and they can eat some of my sunflowers. At least I'll still have offensive plants in the back. But also, uh, the fact that I have a cherry bomb means that I, I do have a little more uh, protection. Okay, let's do that. Just in case a statue comes out. Of course, the statues didn't come out there. Whatever. Definitely want a cherry bomb, like, right here. Just end all of that crap, okay? Uh-oh, here comes a gardener, folks. I don't know what the gardener does. I got an explosion waiting for him. So, hopefully he explodes. Oh, oh, he's shooting at the things, and he's probably disabling them. Bro went and went and uh, shot me with pesticides, bro. That's disgusting. How dare you? They died. They died. What the hell? I'm not okay with that. <laughs> okay, well now we have all of these repeaters. I feel so much better this time, guys. I I think we're good. Second wave of zombies. I was gonna put a thing down. I don't have enough money yet. Okay, you went and you went and broke one of my uh, one of my nuts, bro. I think I'm gonna retaliate now. There we are. Oh man, I don't know what I can actually do about that, guys. Like he sprays my plants. I think they just they're just doomed to die, right? Please help them. Help them. They're gonna die. No, man. Do not let the gardeners do any gardening. Thank you. Oh man. He got me again, guys. He got me again. It's kind of hard to avoid that, to be honest. I think I actually drew out his uh, his fire. I shouldn't have done that. Final wave. That's got to go. That's uh, going to go ahead and do that right away. We do not want that. Okay. Intense. Look at that guy with his flag. Amazing. Okay, put that here in case they break through. Otherwise, we're probably pretty good. Don't want to put anything out here to provoke this provoke this guy or he's gonna spray three of my plants. We're good. Life is good. I guess it helps when you have uh, 20 repeaters. Okay, there it is, folks. There it is, an extra slot. Woohoo! All right, that's actually a really good thing, okay? I'm not just exaggerating. It's really nice to have that. Next, we maybe get cosmetics or something. That's just a statue. I don't know what that means. A mailbox. Wonder what's in the mailbox, bro. So much to figure out. I have so much money. David! David, where are you? I don't know where Dave is, guys, but uh, I, I feel like maybe I need Dave if I'm gonna actually spend my money on anything, you know? Actually, now that I think about it, it's possible that you can buy cosmetics in this game. It's po no, stop. Wait, let me just see what's in here. Same stuff, all good, okay. Yeah, it's possible that you actually spend your money on cosmetics, I'm not really sure. But anyway, look, this is Plants vs. Zombies Neighborhood Defense, the best fan game I've ever played, to be honest, okay? It feels like you're playing PvZ1, but different. And you know, PvZ1 is kind of low quality in a lot of ways. I actually like this sort of like pixelated art style. It's good. Okay, two thumbs up for me. I like this. If you want to see some more, just hit the like button and leave me a comment. And if you want to watch another one of my videos, you can click right here. Thank you so much for watching this one, by the way.